Hi guys, this is Solil Devnani. Welcome to my channel. If you get the error message that says there is no enough iCloud storage available, even though you have iCloud storage. So I'm going to show you how to fix this. So first make sure you select whatever you need from here. In my case, I have turned off photos. You can see that I still do have storage available. Still, I'm not able to back up my device to iCloud. So what are we going to do? We just have to go here, manage storage. And click on backups. Click your iPhone. It's just gonna take a moment. All right, so from here, you can see next backup size, and that's 20.37 GB. In my case, photo library is the ones that, that is taking too much storage. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna turn it off from here. And it's always a good idea to back up your device on iTunes. However, if you're gonna click turn off and delete, it's not gonna delete your pictures. That's, that is already on the iPhone. So let's go ahead. Now we're gonna refresh the page and it's just gonna take a moment here. Right, so from here you can see now next backup size that's 1.31 GB and I have turned off photo library from here. So I'm gonna go back. iCloud backup. Now I'm gonna tap on backup now so you can tap on continue and now it's just gonna show the estimation time remaining so as you can see on my screen it says about one minute remaining and also make sure that you follow the instructions from here make sure that your device is on Wi-Fi and it's connected to the power and it's always a good idea to keep the device logged while backing up on iCloud perfect so from here you can see last successful backup 10 53 p.m. so it means I was able to successfully back up my device on iCloud so I hope this video helps you out if it does like subscribe and share the video I hope to see you in my next video. Bye for now.